Alright guys, so I just had something really exciting happen. So I'm going on a hunt right now for some games, some plushies, uh, anything I can look for retro games. So I stopped at a local GameStop and I got this really cool pickup. It's a Super Mario mini question block light. Great for the desk, thought it was really cool. And I noticed that the plushies that they had were in these like little containers and I asked one of the local GameStop people, I was like, hey, you know, that's really cool. Um, where can I get one of these? I would love to pick it up, purchase it. And she just gave it to me. Like, shout out to Nico. Like, you are awesome, girl. Like, I advise you guys to make friends with your owners, like your local game store people. Like, it's such a great community. Everybody's super nice. We started talking about our tattoos. Um, I used to work for Disney World, so I started talking to her about Disney. She's wearing a cool 90s t-shirt with, you know, the wild thornberries on it and Reptar. Shout out to uh, all you Rugrats fans and 90s kids out there. And yeah, I mean, they were super busy, but she made time for me. Very cool person. Um, we're going on the hunt. We're going to go to Target next and see what we can pick up. So stay tuned. Okay, guys, I just had to take a second because so I'm sitting in my car, right? And I'm debating on whether or not to go into this GameStop because I know that there's one more of those, um, of the holders. And I'm like, oh, you know what? The PlayStation bag I saw in there, that was really cool too. And I forgot on the bottom of my receipt, actually, they, they circled this little um, $5 off any item on your next trip or whatever it is uh, until the end of the month. So I'm like, okay. So I go back into the GameStop, but before I get there, there's this roll of pennies on the ground, like you know, like how you can go to the bank. So basically a roll of coins was on the ground and there's a car parked in front of it. So I thought it was that car. So I asked them if it was theirs, they said no. And then I uh, gave it inside the Dollar Tree. I figured it was probably from the Dollar Tree. So see, look, Dollar Tree's right in front of me. So I give it to them and he's like, oh, you know what, I really appreciate it, no problem. It was just some really good karma, I think. Long story short, I got this PlayStation bag for free because it was $4.99 and with my receipt, I get a free item of $5 off. So this was free and my girl Nico, she gave me another one of these. And I'm like, oh my God, I don't know what's going on with today, but today was a really great day. I made a new friend. Uh, I don't even know what to say. The sun is shining, the glass is clean. Let me know if you know that reference, but I don't know, it, it, it was a really great, great time. Oh, and also another great thing that happened is that I saw this vintage Pokemon Pikachu Game Boy Color holder on eBay, right? And I was interested in it. And then I saw another one, but it was closed in the box, hasn't been used. And then I asked if the seller wouldn't mind um, showing me a picture of the insides of the case just to make sure what they looked like was accurate. And there was a little bit of damage on it. So I was like, oh, okay, like, you know what? I think I'm gonna pass. But there was another person selling one. And I told them that I saw another one because it was true. And this guy gave me 13, 14% off of the total price he originally asked for. And I was just like, that was really cool. You didn't have to do that. Oh my gosh, I am, I think that the Karma Gods, the Pokemon Gods, whatever I'm doing in this gaming community, I love it and I love who I am with this community, connecting with so many people. So I picked that up, it looks brand new, I'll be reviewing that on my channel in a future video. But I'm just really grateful for today guys and I hope you take these little nuggets of karma or inspiration or whatever you want to call them and apply them to your life because ever since I started this journey back in early February, I've met nothing but nice people and I love it. So I'm really happy to be in this community and I can't wait to meet other people. Now let's go to Target. So just came out of Target, didn't see any plushies, nothing really good to be honest. Um, had to pick up some Purell, got two of these. Nothing real exciting except, look at what I got guys. So there was absolutely nothing left for the plushies except for this bad boy. What? Oh my gosh, hang on. So we got another one of these World of Nintendo Little Buddies holders. Guys, this is sick. The last two I have is like cut in half. This one is just one full one. 
So now everything can sit nice and proper on my desk. Look at this, all in all, great pickups, free. Boom. That was originally $4.99, but with my receipt, $0. See, so check this out. PlayStation Tote, $4.99 promo, $0. For the Pokemon plushie, $0. Another one for the Pokemon plushie, $0. The only thing I spent today was $14.99 on this little lamp and $6 on two of these. If that isn't bargain hunting, I don't know what is, to be honest. I encourage you guys to definitely ask your stores, though, first before you start grabbing things off the shelves. You know, just being polite about it is always the best case scenario. Great pickups, a few free things today. The collection's gonna keep growing. I'm gonna have to get a shelf or something to make everything look nice. And um, yeah, I just want to make this channel really great for you guys, and I hope you enjoyed my adventure today. Thanks for staying tuned, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment down below.